What's up, pay to play community? Today I'm going to be taking you through DeFi Kingdoms and I'm going to be showing you what I'm most excited about with this game. It's uh, running on Harmony. That one blockchain here that created its own Harmony mainnet when I started up the game. So I'm going to be starting this up for the first time with you and running through everything. So yeah, let's get into it here. All right, before we hop right into it, let's quickly just look over this their website and their website is put together wonderfully. It's super, super informative and that's why I wanted to go over it real quick. So they got the Jewel token right here. The Jewel token is built and traded on the Harmony One platform using the Uniswap V2 protocol. Secure fast, extremely low trading fees, extremely low trading fees. The game features, which I'm going to go over more in detail in the game, but they got the swap, the pool, gardens, and bank. Bank is staking. The gardens is like the liquidity pool. And here you can add liquidity pairings. And then they got the swapping tokens, so you can always cash out if you need to. They're coming out with the heroes. They already enlisted the heroes. We'll talk about that in the game. They got land coming out, which is epic. Love buying real estate, land, whatever, in any blockchain game. Love it. Buildings. Perfect. Equipment. We're all going to talk about that. Here's the little uh, view of the roadmap. And they're hitting their deadlines, it looks like. So they got the bank to invest in Jewel. That's like the staking. And then what we're looking at here is... So the heroes have arrived. You can buy a hero in the tavern. Kingdoms. The fog of war on the world map will be rolled back to review mountains. Okay, so that's how we're going to be able to like see. 25 kingdom plots will be given to random winners. Oh, that's nice. Buildings. Kingdoms will have randomly placed resource nodes which can be mined, harvested by buildings placed next to them. So this, we're super early. This is talking about 2022 quarter one. We hop over to, we're going to look at their white paper more towards the end of the video. We can see that Jewel trading at 360 right now. It, it hit an all time high of about $5. Did after it did this massive pump up here, which is <laughs> crazy. So $5 is an all time high. You're getting in pretty low right here. I think it's going to start. I believe it's going to start coming back up. Not financial advice, but I'm taking advantage of the APYs. I'm going to be showing you how to get one onto your MetaMask. Say you're playing a game using a layer two solution to the Ethereum blockchain like Harmony. Harmony is a layer two solution. I was looking into playing my uh, the DeFi Kingdoms and I learned that I actually need to use the Harmony mainnet in order to play this game. If we hop over to the CoinGecko, we see Harmony is trading at 28 cents right now. And you can buy Harmony on Binance or Binance US crypto. And I caught word that it might be even going on to Coinbase, Pro Coinbase, the exchange. So you're going to hop over to the wallet extension. And you're going to do it. You're going to set it up just like you set up your MetaMask. But you're going to set it up once you get harmony onto your wallet all you got to do is go to an exchange buy the one token withdraw it to your harmony wallet you copy this address and then you will withdraw you take this and you will then withdraw right and then you copy you're in the one network which is the harmony network and then you will paste your address in here Okay, then you select how many tokens you want, and then you go through the withdrawal. That's if you're using Binance.us. I'm sure Binance.com is the same thing. But once you have, and it's very simple, but once you have Harmony on your account, you're going to click send. Well, first you're going to want to copy your account, main account, copy it. Come over here. Send paste don't worry about changing this do not change this 
can test it out by just sending one because the gas fees are it's right here. Look at that. Gas fees are ridiculous. There's no such thing as a gas fee here. Put your password in. Prove it. Now watch. I can hop over here. Boom. Instantly. Mainnet. This is the power of layer two. Now, this is a cool little extension too because they have the Ethereum as well. So you, you can go on both different uh, chains right here. I have yet to look into all this, but it looks like they're doing some good stuff here as well. Good stuff to keep an eye on too. Now I'm going to proceed to do DeFi Kingdoms. Let's go. Let's go here. All right, so it's going to cost a gas fee in order to create this character. That's why we had to get one onto here. Man, Harmony, the one blockchain. This is going to be, this is going to be insane here. Okay, so one thing I'm looking at is I want to see the gardens. I heard the gardens have some kind of just insane liquidity pool. So I want to be a liquidity provider to earn this new token. So it looks like will receive jewel and that's the in-game currency so we're gonna want to look at what types of liquidity we can provide so we got busd aprs at 1000 percent oh my god look at these apys dude oh my all right so you got to create your own liquidity pair all right in order to do that then you want to head over to the marketplace there's a few different ways of doing it but this is one way that i'm understanding how to do it so you can see that you create a pair you can choose any pair that you want from the garden so my pair is jewel in one and you can see what i'm earning here which is is massive returns i did this last night with just a tiny little deposit for the liquidity and it's already almost hitting one and one of these one jewel is like five dollars so just overnight eight hours looking in the bank here in the bank you can also deposit any leftover jewel or any earned jewel into their uh, staking this is more staking not a liquidity pool they also have nfts that you can buy and will be used later on in the game let's look at the heroes quick so each hero will have its own stats and the stats will go towards their profession and i'll tell you about the profession a little bit so say you have strength as a stat that's going to go better with mining okay so keep that in mind just a little look at their heroes and the heroes will be able to complete quests and go on missions and fight monsters later on in the game i believe okay so we go over to profession we can see gardener miner Forger and Fisher. Portal, I have yet to really understand much, but I think it's how you summon a hero. But all heroes, I think, have already been minted and summoned right away. So, that one, you might have to look into a little bit more on that. Take a little look at this map. And I love their, their music, too, behind the game. This game kind of reminds me of Tibia. I don't know if anybody can relate to that, but... I don't know. That, uh... We're early stages in this game. I always love these little 2D type games and uh, I'm gonna definitely be keeping an eye on it. We're gonna hop over to the white paper, look a little bit into it. All right, let's take a look at their roadmap here. It looks like they completed phase one in the community phase. They have a nice discord that's pretty big. They're gonna be coming out with kingdoms and lands. Got a hero NFT sale that's gonna be coming out here. This is going to be something to keep your eye on, guys. I'm going to continue to look into this more deeply and get you a better understanding of this game. But right now, I just wanted to get this out to you guys as quickly as possible. Because of that liquidity pool, you could take serious advantage of that. 
but right now it's still in its early, early stages, and we are, we're still in year zero of blockchain gaming. We have tons and tons of stuff to look into. I want to make sure that I bring you quality projects, and I know that this, there's opportunity here, okay? There's also, also a lot of risk involved. I'm not a financial advisor, but make sure you guys check this stuff out here, okay? So DeFi Kingdoms aims to be a whole ecosystem of features that includes the jewel token, the DEX, the gardens, and our NFT assets, heroes, equipments, and kingdoms. It can be performed with those NFTs, so kind of like staking. I believe this they're going to have it all. Our team is fully engaged and in love. So I have yet to see the team, but it looks like they were audited. That's always a very good thing to see. Double check on that. See if you can find who the developers are. So we see we got to look into the developers a little bit more. We want to make sure we got a game. That's good. We got actual front end and back end. We got the team here. We got a nice roadmap hitting all its deadlines. We They even added in a nice little audit. You want to keep checking in on these things, okay, to make sure that you're avoiding any types of rug pulls and less risk with the liquidity pool. All right, I just wanted to get this to you guys quick. See you in the next video here.